investors. This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. What's going on, everyone? This is Jacob Shoup. You are watching the 4 p.m. stock market update. I hope you all had a great day. Uh, during the show, I was, actually, I was actually joined by Tim Ord of the Ord Oracle. If you missed that or want to kind of review what he was going over when he was on, you can go to our YouTube channel at Tiger Financial News Network, and our producer is hard at work. He's going to get that up for you guys uh, right after the end of programming today. Make sure uh, to consider giving us a like and a subscribe. If you do decide to check that clip out, uh, we have the composite off about 2.76%, Dow Jones Industrial off about 0.9%, uh, the DXY off about 027 Still, I think we can make an argument for maybe a bit of a stronger dollar too. Uh, Germany did avoid a recession, uh, but their growth was just about 0.2. Uh, so just narrowly avoided that. Um, of course, their industries are just kind of contracting right now. Uh, so you can still definitely see a uh, persistently higher dollar. I wonder, too, if in some capacity that is influencing some of the solve on gold. I'm not sure, though. You have crude oil trading up about 2.77%. You have the E-mini up about 1.8, uh, off about 1.8. And then the gold contract trading down 1.55%. The Russell also getting smacked today off about 1.75. And then silver uh, really taking it today off about 3.6%. Uh, you have... Amazon coming out, right? So this is going to be huge, right? Because not everyone uh, enjoyed things that Microsoft and Meta had a report today. Amazon's still roughly in the same kind of boat uh, in the regards that they are going to be increasing CapEx on infrastructure. That's going to be a major thing. So, you know, maybe hold off. I guess you can't really right now, or maybe you can, but hold off on any kind of an intense, uh, you know, zero day expiration, uh, you know, bullish for Amazon. Now, I'm going to be looking really closely to see what their growth uh, projection is going to be uh, essentially in their cloud for AWS. Now, of course, AWS is, is the biggest that there is. Um, but if you get any kind of contraction, then I might rethink uh, potentially trying to get into some kind of leveraged uh, Microsoft position tomorrow. But uh, we'll see what happens. Folks, thank you so much for joining me. Uh, we'll see you tomorrow, 9 a.m. with Tommy O'Brien for the morning market kickoff, followed by Basil Chapman, Steve Rhodes, Larry Pesavento. And then I will be with you to close out the day at 3 p.m. Take care.